man. The captain was right, man. I shouldn't have lost my temper like that. I mean, I really let those a-holes get to me. Yeah, but those morons were asking for it. And I've yet to hear one intelligent thing come out of Mason's mouth in years. Yeah. What's up, dude? Hey. Starsky and Hutch! Wait up! You see what hey. I mean? Starsky and Hutch? How old are you? The least you can do is call us Crockett and Tubbs. Ooh, I want to be Crockett. Perfect. I like Tubbs. Mommy Vice. Really. You two don't dress good enough. The captain wanted me to give you these new orders. <clears throat> this, this, this can't be right. Cimarron Squally. Some low-level drug dealer. What does he have to do with the Angela DeLuca murder? Yeah. Spoiler alert. You guys are off the DeLuca case. Both of you. What? Captain says you're too close to it. What are you talking about? You know, with your brother being the prime suspect and everything, he assigned someone else to the case. And let me guess. You volunteered. Damn right. So you two stay out of it and stick to babysitting drug dealers. Have fun, ladies. I really hate that guy. Yeah, I know. He's a real charmer. Jesus Christ, this is a 48-hour surveillance, including an overnight stakeout. God damn it. What the fuck? This is, this is nuts. Why is this guy so important all of a sudden? Because it says right there, he's the main provider of Special K throughout the entire city. That's why. So what? That's vice. We're homicide, man. I mean, what possible connection does this guy have with, with Angie DeLuca or, or any murder for that matter? So what do you want to do? Well, the first thing I have to do is I got to call Francesca. And let her know I'm not going to be around for the next two days. She's going to love that. And then I guess we uh, got to go and find this Mr. Squally. Look at the way they're looking at each other. Yes. It's not like he's going to just like, huh? lick her face. <laughs> oh, look who's here. Speak of the devil. Ooh. Mason Barnes. Santos. Yeah. Cool. The B team. B yeah. team. That's good. Cool. Yeah. An original. So what are you guys laughing at, huh? Were you looking at your paychecks? We saw something else. Is that, I like Is that B enough for you? <laughs> Help me understand something, Santos. When your fiance wakes up in the morning, does she say, I want to be with the mob celebrity? Or does she say, hmm, I want to be with a wannabe super cop? <laughs> <laughs> you guys are real funny. Oh, thank you. You guys are hysterical. You should try open mic night. We, we oh, try. Thanks. Thank you. Yes. I appreciate that. Hey, Santos, what's the matter, man? Your lady missed that bad boy love? Ooh. Maybe it's because Ricky's half black. Ouch. What the hell's wrong with you? The city's in turmoil and you fools fighting each other. Don't you have some reports to write? Cole, Santos, in my office, now! We'll see you on the outside. What do you think? That's Cimarron, right? That's definitely Cimarron. All right, hit it, man. Yeah. Yeah, Black Lives Matter. Just want y'all to know that up front. Now, who are you two clowns? Detective Santos. This is Yates. Santos? You're Ricky Santos' brother, aren't you? Yeah, I am. You know what? You need to be out arresting him and putting him away for life. Yeah, because you're such a model citizen, ain't ya? <laughs> mm-hmm. Where well, you been for the last 48 hours, Cimarron? If you must know, officer, I was in her last night and this morning. Is there a law against that, detective? You and your lady friend mind stepping out of the car, please? Yes, as a matter yeah, of fact, I mind. do mind. Am I being arrested for something? 
How's the Special K business going there, Cimarron? I don't know. What can I say? It's the breakfast of champions. Yeah. Well, you mind telling me how 120 kilos keep passing through the city every day? Oh, 120 kilos. Wow. So that's a lot. A lot. Look, officer, I'm a small businessman. I sell Christmas candles. Yeah, I'm crying see? Out loud. This is one of my favorites. Want to smell it? That one smells like her. Look, if I was running 120 kilos per week, man, I would not be here. I'd be in the Bahamas somewhere with her and her mama. It's a pretty nice ride you got here, Cimarron. The old candle biz must really be, uh, <sighs> booming. Yeah, 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 whatever, man. Can we go now? Can we just go? I got my eye on you. Get the hell out of here. You know what? You're very hostile. You need to calm that down, man. Get yourself a girlfriend or something. Come on, Ricky. We got you. Your DNA was all over that girl, and I saw you with her. Of course my DNA was on her, man. If you look real close, you found out it was also in her. What do you think we did last night, man? I screwed her. Didn't kill her. She was alive when I left. And when was that? Ricky, you don't have to say anything else. What the hell are you doing here? I'm here representing Mr. Santos. You, you got to be shitting me. This guy is guilty. You, you was with the girl last night. You saw Listen, this. Listen, you don't know that. You have to prove There's it There's DNA evidence all over. He is doing? innocent until proven guilty. Please don't do this, okay? We got him right now, okay? Christian, I'm doing my job and you're doing your job. That is your job, just like my job is defending him. So don't. please, I need some private time with my client now. Please. Private time with my client now. Please. Unbelievable. Both of you, in my office now! What the hell were you guys doing in there? God damn it, son of a bitch! Fuck! Close the goddamn door! You can't be on this case! Why not, Captain? Huh? Why not? Because he's your brother, that's why not! I made the arrest, and I need to see this through. I'm the only one diligent enough to go and find the truth, and you know that! Get out of here! Get out of here! Both of you! And if this thing goes sideways, I'll have both your badges. Chris, it's me. I'm going to Barstow right now for a homicide. It's a female, 25 years old. But here's the kicker. They found her with an LA ID on this girl. So guess whose presence is being requested? Yeah, that's right, man. Okay. I will meet you there and I'll text you the address. Z's up on the docks. Listen to me. Listen to me. Local PD got a call two hours ago. They found the body. Well, who is this person? No ID. Fine. Let's go find out. Watch your step. Yeah, I know. I already stepped in something back there. So, what we got? Let's see. What is it? I know that girl. What are you talking about? Ricky was with her last night. You mean your brother, Ricky? Yeah. I saw them. Oh, fuck. All right. Like this, Ricky? Exactly like that, chica. Ricky. All right, chill. But you recognize LA's finest when you see it? Cool, so you've just got a permit for that. You got it, boss. Ricky, Ricky, always with the ladies, huh? How you doing, honey? Get lost. Why don't you take your papa like that? 
Or comment allez-vous and pomme frite to you too. Get the fuck out of here. So, hermano, como esta? I'm doing great. Recognize this? Yeah, you got a big date tonight? Oh, Francesca loves when I use this on her. Angela DeLuca. Sound familiar? What about her? We just pulled her body out of a swimming pool. What? You're under arrest for murder. <laughs> you got to be kidding. Does it look like I'm kidding you? You're making a mistake as usual, Kristen. Uh-huh. I hear they like to call you pretty. They like pretty people in prison. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. Ricky, what do you mean to do? Make a call. Guys, clear back. We're coming through. We're coming through. Back. 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 What is the evidence against your brother? Susan, you know I can't answer that. Ricky, what do you have to say? 